This local sports report is brought to you by the Victus Academy, building excellence in academics, hockey, and leadership. Check out their website for more information at victusacademy.com or give them a call at 519-219-5900. Kitchener native Justin Ertl is heading to North Bay next season as a member of the battalion after being drafted into the OHL last Saturday. It's been an amazing week for you, I would imagine, Justin. Congratulations, first of all. Uh, what was your reaction when obviously you saw your name pop up on the board and, and then it was North Bay? Yeah, you know, um, my, my dad got drafted there, so uh, I'm very excited and uh, trying to obviously carry on what, what he did there and, and trying to improve uh, upon how I play and just just have fun with it. That's really neat, eh? That you know what he can sort of share his experience with you from the time you know when he was drafted to North Bay. What's that like as a as a family? And obviously your brother Jake Ertle as well is having a great career. You know, joining the Stratford Warriors this past season. A real hockey family from the yeah. sounds of it. Yeah, you know, um, my dad carried a very good legacy in North Bay, and and he knows a lot of people that would help me in North Bay and. and I'm just, just really excited to get things going. Who are you as a player, and what can they expect to see in North Bay? Uh, I'm a very, very humble and hardworking player. Uh, I, I see the ice very well, and I, I think just, just my hard work and uh, my skill set just really helps how I play. Talk to me about the Victus Academy. Obviously, they've had an influence on you and your development, and this is about more than on ice development on the ice behind us. This is also about in the classroom and in the weight room over here as well. Speak to them and the impact they've had on you. Yeah, I've really been very fortunate to go to this school. Uh, we get on ice and workouts all, all in, during the school day. Uh, for some hockey players, you have to go out and, and spend a little extra time and go to gyms, but we have it all in, in one space. So uh, it's just really been a fun experience and, and I'm very fortunate. Who are some of the people here that have had maybe the biggest influence on you? I know that it's a small school as well from the perspective yeah. of it's a real family here, right? Yeah. Uh, but, so all the all nice guys have been very, very nice to me. Uh, just, just going to school with a bunch of uh, draft picks like uh, you mentioned before, uh, it just really helps to push me. and. Uh, I try to push them too, so I, I've just been very lucky to go with, to school with them and they just make me better every day. There's so much local talent coming out of this region and four from the Victus Academy. Ryan Cook, Matthew Saw, Braden Bowman and yourself. Can you just sort of speak to the community here just in the sense of we're developing great hockey players in the yeah. 519 and I think this is just perfect evidence of it yeah. that we've seen here over the past week. Yeah, they, they've, they're very great, good hockey players and um, it's been fun playing against them and playing with them. So uh, I think it just speaks to how hard they work and what they put into uh, hockey and, and in, the, in the gym uh, and just how hard they work on and off the ice. So. Here's the thing too, the hard work actually really begins now for yeah. you, right? You know, you've obviously been through a great process with the Toronto Red Wings, but now you get to go to rookie camp and obviously you have to work hard this summer to give yourself an opportunity this fall. Uh, speak about the Toronto Red Wings, obviously you got to the OHL Cup final, what an incredible experience that must have been yeah. for you and the team. They're a major, major part of this as well, helping yeah. you get to the next level. Yeah, I, I've been very lucky to play on such a great team. Uh, we had a rough start. Uh, we, we lost our first six games and then came back and just started to get on a roll. Um, I played with Nolan Dan, uh, who got drafted to Sarnia, yep. uh, and Luca Del Bell, who got drafted to Mississauga. So I played with some great hockey players, and they, they just pushed me to where I am today. We better give Chandler Romeo a shout-out as well. He was a defenseman of the Toronto Red Wings, and he was drafted by the Hamilton Bulldogs last weekend. Last one for you, the coaches. Who are some of the people with the Toronto Red Wings that had a major impact on you because without those coaches and their teaching skills what are they teaching you there that helps you and makes you better uh, if if I make a mistake in practice they always uh, touch up on on what I need to work on and uh, if I mess up then they they teach me on, on what to do better um, just just who they are as people I think um, I try to idolize my myself after some of the coaches because they're just um, so like just so hum such humble people and they've just always been nice to me. So uh, I've been very fortunate to have a coaching staff this year. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.